I'm really excited this year to be bringing Hofesh Hector as guest director of Brighton Festival 2014. Hofesh, as many of our audience will know, is the extraordinary choreographer, musician, visual artist uh, who has worked at the festival now since 2008. Um, Hofesh Hector Company has been resident with Brighton Dome and Brighton Festival since that time and we've commissioned him and his company repeatedly over the years. And we feel that now it's incredibly exciting to be giving him the role to lead the festival and bring the artists that he particularly feels uh, show the way he sees the world. Hofesh's work is incredibly imaginative, inventive, sometimes shocking, um, beautiful dance work and, uh, and extraordinary in its movement vocabulary. There are moments of incredible symmetry and, uh, and joy, but also real challenge and provocation. We feel that uh, his take on the world is something that, um, that will really resonate with Brighton and Hove audiences, uh, with Brighton Festival audiences, and be something that really shifts the, uh, the way Brighton Festival presents itself to the world. Every year, a guest director comes and shows their unique take on the world, and this year is no exception. Hofesh, as a choreographer, obviously um, has brought a concentration on dance to the festival programme, but, uh, but the whole programme is as eclectic and varied as ever. This year, Hofesh has, uh, has brought a number of choreographers that he uh, really admires and respects. Um, particularly, we look at William Forsyth's work. One of the things we've talked a lot with Hofesh about is paradox and particularly the paradox and contradiction of artists who dare to stand apart from the crowd, who dare to tell it the way they see it and do it the way they feel it, and yet also because of that achieve such a following and such popularity. And there's a, there's a tension in there which, uh, which I think Hofesh finds really curious and we've really enjoyed exploring. Part of what's important about Brighton Festival is that it brings new work um, and that we create new work with some of the world's best artists. Hoffa Schechter, obviously, we have commissioned several times in the past and this year is no exception. We um, worked with a number of other festivals and uh, organisations to help him create his new work, Sun, and it has been on a world tour uh, and will be coming home, if you like, to the festival, to open the festival in May. It's an incredibly rich work, full of ideas, um, almost too many to, uh, to explain, but it has given us an incredibly rich platform on which to build our programme, and we've really started with some of the ideas that Sun presents as a jumping off point for the rest of the programme. We're also very excited to be bringing Dmitry Krimov's extraordinary work Opus number seven. Dmitry Krimov is one of uh, the great directors of Russian theatre at the moment, and uh, we've worked together with London International Festival of Theatre, Lyft, Norfolk and Norwich Festival, and Northern Stage. And that work uh, will receive its UK premiere at Brighton Festival. For me, this year is working with uh, Hoffa Schechter, who is a, a choreographer who has worked a lot here locally in Brighton and has presented work on the stage here in, in Brighton Dome on many occasions. His passion and his philosophy and his creative process has inspired much of the programme and has helped us to shape it along the way. We're trying to present work where audiences can really get a different perspective on society or on culture and in some of the work that's particularly provocative like Hoffish's own work Son that he's dealing with some of the ugly injustices of society and audiences are being challenged in, an, in new ways. A lot of the work presented in the festival is not necessarily easy. It's there to provoke and it's there to be cutting edge and it's there to do something different and something new.